want you, baby. My sugar boo, I'm levitating. The Milky Way, we're renegading. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got you, moonlight. You're my starlight. I need you all night. Come on, dance with me. I'm levitating. You, moonlight. You're my starlight. I need you. just understood that we have a beautiful mirror here in our hotel room which I didn't notice before and I think I think taking a photo here looks quite nice today I'm wearing my uh, Maj dress which I have for I don't know three four years but it's so classy I'm just loving it it has this white top and a simple black skirt and well we are ready for the day uh, on Lake Maggiore and also we are planning to visit some uh, factory outlets probably today we will see how it goes I just wanted to quickly speak about uh, about some of the things we did yesterday so the day yesterday was really full of things we visited Bellagio and Varenna so we really loved Varenna more than Bellagio as you probably noticed uh, yesterday and well Varenna has this kind of romantic feel to it while Bellagio is really more touristic and uh, you can feel the crowds of tourists there even in spring it's not even summer yet and Varenna is more calm and more traditional and local if you can say so the gardens that we visited in Varenna is i think a must to visit they are really beautiful really big you can walk around you can sit uh, on the bench enjoy the views take a break have like a uh, like quick lunch if you can uh, take it with you uh, also there is a small cafe inside of the um, gardens if you want to buy a coffee out there there's, there are tons of places to take pictures if you are interested in taking beautiful pictures for your social media or just for memories. Well, uh, also uh, what, uh, what we did yesterday is obviously we took lots of ferries. We had how many ferries yesterday? One, two, we had three ferries. Ferries are generally, generally 460 uh, for one way per adult. And uh, ferries, uh, being on a ferry is quite cold in spring if you're outside and if you want to uh, see all of the beautiful things around from the outside deck. Uh, it is very windy there and very cold so I advise you to grab a coat and maybe a hat and a scarf because when we were going back to our hotel yesterday evening on the ferry it was really cold so we hid in, uh, in the inside cabin. But it, it was pretty nice, the scenery is very beautiful from there and I think if you are on a budget taking a ferry is a really good idea, you don't, really don't need to take this water taxi which usually costs 50 euro per person. However, uh, if it is summer and if you have extra budget uh, and it's, if it's not cold, of course, uh, water taxi is uh, a nice th thing to try too because the views here are absolutely stunning. So that was the day yesterday. Today is going to be a nice day as well, hopefully. And we have to say goodbye to our hotel in Cadenabia today and we're moving to our hotel on Lake Maggiore. This was a very beautiful place here. It has the most amazing views on the Lake Como. And if you are after the beautiful views and you don't really care if the hotel is a little bit too old, is a little bit old, uh, this hotel is for you. The views here are really, really stunning. They are just one of the most beautiful views from the hotel I have seen in my life. So I will show you a little bit more of our hotel and then we will get in the car and head to our next destination.
We decided to come to a spot called the balcony of Italy. It is situated on the top of the hill or it's better to call it a mountain called Sikignola. I hope I'm pronouncing it right and it's really really high and the road is quite complicated and narrow. I felt sick the whole way because of uh, the change of the uh, height of the altitude and now I'm still a little bit sick, but the view is worth it. Uh, it is absolutely wonderful. We can see Switzerland and Italy from here, and the views talk for themselves. You can see everything. So we are now in uh, the outlet of the brand Herno. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Uh, they are, their speciality is producing down coats and here in the outlet uh, the, regular, the usual price for the down coat is around a thousand euro and the regular price is like a thousand and five hundred. But for example this one is three hundred and eighty five here and a regular price is seven hundred and seven.
Hello from Lake Maggiore. We arrived to a town which is situated close to this lake. This day was long as all of the previous days. We would drove through uh, the territory between the two lakes, between Lake Como and Lake Maggiore. We went, we went on the top of the mountain uh, uh, called Sik Sikignola. The view was uh, there was wonderful, but the road was really complicated for our car, and also it made me feel sick because of all of the turns we had to make and how high we had to go. But the views were wonderful. Also, we went through little Italian villages. We visited uh, two factory outlets. We, we visited Loro Piana factory outlet. Uh, I didn't find anything interesting there, so I didn't even film there because I was interested in their shoes and they didn't have any interesting shoes at all. And also we went to uh, Hernov factory outlet and that one was nice, but I didn't really need anything uh, from outerwear, so I didn't choose anything there but for myself. And now we are in our hotel. We also had a dinner in a restaurant on the lake, on Lake Maggiore. The dinner was okay, just regular Italian food, nothing special. So now we're, we checked in into our hotel. Our hotel is very nice, very local, but this is a hotel from the B&B uh, hotels. They are very popular here in Europe. And this is called the B&B Hotel uh, Maggiore Malpensa. I think uh, it, the price for this hotel wasn't really uh, big. It, I think it is 65 euro per night with breakfast, which is wonderful because we have our own parking here and I actually really like this hotel and I wanted to show it to you. So uh, the rooms look cute like this with this little, uh, with this nice uh, Italian windows and you have your parking place straight in front of your room, which is very comfy because you can get all of your luggage straight into the room and you don't need to carry all your luggage. The room is really like nice and clean and new and it doesn't smell like old stuff. They have warm blankets, which we didn't have when we were on Lake Como, so I was always cold. So hopefully this night is going to be really calm, warm and comfortable. And I think I will prepare a cup of tea for myself and go to sleep. See you tomorrow.